All right, so it's good to be back making a few videos. It's been quite a while, I know that, so I apologize, but um, I'm well and truly back into uh, getting out there and making videos and hopefully putting out some good content over the next few months. Uh, so I just thought I'd make this little video to give you a little update on my plans for my fishing over the coming months. So I'm currently down at an old estate lake in Norfolk, uh, just doing days only as that's all you're allowed on here. There's some really nice um, fish in here going over 40 pound and um, that's the ideal place for me at the moment because uh, a lot of my time was taken up by looking after the dog that you can see next to me, um, my husky Eddie, uh, when my wife was at work so I wasn't able to get out and do that much fishing. So now it's ideal, uh, when the weather's all right, I can just pop down for a quick day, bring him along with me, um, as I'm starting to get him used to being out on the bank now and do a little bit of fishing. So uh, it's hard going, it's not very high stock in this lake at all, um, with a few big fish. So fingers crossed we'll have something um, over the next few weeks. So that's my uh, plan with the immediate future. Uh, but I've got lots of other exciting things going on over the next few months. In a couple of weeks time, we've got the inter -Nutri Club. Uh, club Cup. So that, what that is, is Nutribates have decided to do a um, match this year between the team members. So we had a draw um, and I'm coming up against Richard Logan in a few weeks. So that'll be at Norton Disney and the uh, concept for it is a 48 hour match with the overall weight, um, biggest weight being the winner. So not largest fish, not most fish, but total overall weight. So. Uh, it should be fun. We're going to go to Norton Disney, uh, decide on the lake when we get there, uh, depending on the weather and availability, um, and uh, just see how it goes. So I'll be filming all of that and doing a video of, um, about that and both of our tactics and all of that kind of stuff. So uh, it'll be really interesting to fish with some new people and to do a bit of match style fishing. Um, well, carp match fishing, not you know, not pole and float. I'm not not that good, um, <laughs> but. Uh, yeah, it should be should be interesting because so I've never done it before, and it'll be interesting to go to new venues, new people, uh, and fish against the clock, which should be quite fun. Um, so if we make it through that round, then um, I'll make videos on the following rounds, depending on who we get drawn against and where we end up in the country. Uh, so yeah, it should be good fun. Uh, I'll be doing all the review videos that I've been doing over the last few years that seem to be quite popular and people seem to appreciate them. Um, I still. Um, try and keep myself uh, unlinked to any tackle companies so that all my reviews are unbiased. Uh, so they'll be coming out again over the next next few months. Uh, and then in the summer, I have the YouTube Vlogger Social again that I went on last year. Um, this year, I think it's at Fort Lee um, rather than the Coking Farm that it was last year. So that'll be really interesting. Gonna try and film a lot more there this year um, and make a really nice video from that. So um, once I've done the spring, um, on here it's got a close season so i'll probably then go on to wayward fisheries which i've done some videos before on um, fishing the ocean pit and uh, number one pit i haven't decided which one to concentrate on yet so uh, i'll be doing some videos on those and also plenty of trips around the country as well so yeah plenty to look forward to plenty of videos to be coming out over the uh, coming year um, so thanks for watching click like and subscribe if you haven't already um, to keep in touch with everything that's coming out over the next few months. Uh, so that's all for now and I'll catch you in the next one.